Hey, so I'm interested in showing you the Boca or the Focus tool. Um, this lesson, real easy to use, is a premium effect, so it's something that you would need to pay for. Um, but just to give you an idea of how it's used, there's a couple different modes. There's symmetric or tilt, um, radial, which is probably the most common that I've seen, and a linear. Um, the blur is at zero right now, so I'm just going to increase that so you can kind of see it happening. Um, but you can see it happening down here. You can also see where it says premium here. That's where it's paid for. So with this one selected, the symmetric, I can move this to focus on what I want to focus on, whether it's the volleyball or whatever. And then gradually as it gets out into the extended areas, it's losing its focus. And I can change all of this. Um, and I can tilt it depending on what I need. So he's in focus, the ball's in focus, um, but his, the sand, the audience, they're out of focus. And so that puts what's most important is, in this image at the priority. I can also do a radial. So now it's focused on the volleyball um, and I can change the blur effect from that. So now all of this is in focus. This is not in focus. Um, I can also move that to put the focus on his face rather than anything else. Um, and maybe I want to include the, the volleyball as best as I can. So I'm kind of stretching this out a little bit because these two um, objects are probably the most important of the picture and that would make a really good focus. And then the linear focus, of course, very similar to the tilt. It's at a little bit of a different area. Um, and I can, of course, drag that as well. Now, the bokeh is over here. I can mess with the settings um, as well. The size of the blur, the intensity of the blur. And this is, the, the word bokeh, I'm not even sure if I'm saying it right, but it is the aesthetic um, out of focus um, and parts of it in focus just to make it pleasing to the eye. And it's all done... Um, just to, to really kind of drive home what you should be looking at. So I'm going to go one more step here. Now that we have the idea of this, let me focus on the volleyball and him again with this radial. But I can also, I don't know why you would do this right now for this, but I would want to invert it. I can invert it. So if I don't want to show somebody's face, but I want to show the rest of the picture for some reason, I can blur them out of a little bit as well. So there's an invert button as well. So this is the blur effect, the focus effect, or the bokeh effect. That's the tool and how you use it.